Hey, what's up, everyone? So, big contest going on right now in the Light Gun Lunatics Facebook Club. If you're not in that, please join, and you can take part in this. So, what this contest is for is to win this Viper submachine gun. Now, the paint job, when it comes out, is going to be custom to the Light Gun Lunatics group. So, you will have a one-of-a-kind gun when you win. Um, so just join the group and you'll go to your features and you're going to find posts with all the details so down here i have this little short video that's going on it explains the uh, rules which pretty much i'll briefly go through them no crosshairs give me a second to get back in there okay so the rules are crosshairs are allowed reload cannot be automatic have it to where we can see your reload in the uh, videos uh, single shot only so with no automatic no pulse firing you can use your light gun or Wiimote no mouse and only video entries where you submit it you submit in a post titled light gun lunatic contest when to blamcom um, use a hashtag lgl blamcon sg that will greatly help us find out um pretty much find out your submission it's easy to get your submission lost in all these posts but this is going on from now until june 1st costs nothing to to enter just get the game even the game is free and i want to show you how to download that and also add it to your launch box i know i showed a previous video on that kind of going over it quickly but this one i want to show you a bit more detail on what to do just so i can make sure that everyone who wants to take part in this doesn't get left out of the loops and even if you don't win um we're going to have random picks for some good retro rebels gears t-shirts hoodies coffee mugs just whatever all right and uh thanks to uh Adam Armstrong, you can find him at Armstrong Arcades on YouTube as well. And this is our standings right now. Um, I'm an admin, so I am ineligible to win, but I will still participate just because I'm competitive. So all, all I can win is just having the highest score. Uh, right now, we got Liz Ramos up at 57, Oscars at 56, Jerome Geno's at 51 at 20. So pretty much try to break the 5,000 barrier. It is a tight race already. And the reason using that hashtag is so important, I, I can just, or anyone can just hashtag LGL Blancon SG, click on it, and you'll find all the information and entries through here. Kind of a recent hashtag out, so hopefully it'll catch on. It'll make finding your entry much easier. All right, so with that out of the way, let's go ahead and get started on getting BlamCon. So what is BlamCon? It's the shooting gallery game off of Steam. It doesn't really take much on your machine to even run it. I'm sure a potato can probably run this game. All right, but yeah, so take it, download it. I already have it played, so I can play it now if I want to. And even just right now, you don't need to put it on your launch box. Once you download the game, you can just play it as is in a work with the gun no problem i'll get into the uh, gun buttons once we get into the game okay but if you are wanting to run it through your launch box first of all you're going to note this number right here two six five zero two zero zero you can pause this video write this number down but that's what you're going to need to get it into launch box box and we're just going to do a import anywhere you may not already have Windows as a system now, which is fine. Just hit add, this will automatically add it for you. We're gonna go straight down to launching and right here on application path is where you're gonna need that number. Okay, but first you're gonna need steam colon forward slash forward slash run game ID and forward slash and replace this number with the number from the steam library. Okay, and once you get that up, that's it. That's all you need to do there. Okay, and just type in BlamCon Shooting Gallery. Uh, change your platform to Windows, and you can search for metadata, but nothing's going to come out, and that's not going to matter. 
So once you have that set up, once you have your launching Steam dot forward slash forward slash one game ID forward slash two six five zero two zero zero, then you are good. Okay, you're going to click your OK. You should have a new platform pop up called Windows if you don't have that already. Okay, so go ahead and double click on Blamcon. You want to have your open Steam window pop up. You want to have the game and you know, just fire it away. So we want our guys to of course with this, so if you're not running Ascending, then you're basically done. If you're Ascending people like myself, then we need to do the additional step, which is we're going to add a new shape to this. So go ahead and hit your escape and get out of this. And get your reshade. If you have it on your tools, even following me, we put it here. But if not, you can just find you a version of reshade online it doesn't matter which version you find all right so to search for reshade it'll pull up you're just going to download you'll want the uh, regular 6.11 that will probably work but i've just i just never used it and this has been perfectly fine for me open it then you can just put this wherever you want in your library it really doesn't matter where you put it. I always just like to keep it tucked away with my launch box. Just so it's easier for me to find everything. But since I already have uh, mine here, I'm just going to use mine. But it's all going to work the same. So come here and open up your... Reshade. Wherever it is. All right, so open up your reshade, and you're going to look for your game. Now, my game's already here since I found it, but this is how you find the majority of your Steam games. Go to your browse. Go into your library where your Steam game's at. Mine's at C. Yours could be D, E, wherever you have yours at. And pull up the Steam application. It's usually going to be tucked away in Program Files 86. You'll go to Steam. Steam apps, common, and a shooting gallery. And you're going to want the uh, shooting gallery exe right here. You're going to hit open. Now you're going to have to play around on this. Um, some users found 9 worked for them. For me, I found 10, 11, 12 worked. So if 10, 11, 12 doesn't work for you, then come back and do DirectX 9. We'll go to next. Uh, just keep sweet FX checked. Okay, hit finish. All right, and that's it. Now uh, go ahead and go back and open up your game. Do it through Steam, do it through LaunchBox, just however you want to do it. Oh, and then we'll come back and add some media here as well. Okay, so we're launching. Now, I already have my border set up, but you'll hit Home. You'll hit Skip Tutorial. And uh, none of these will be uh, checked out the gate. So all you're focused on right now is border. So click on your border. I'll change this to what it would be at default. Okay, so it's going to look like your letterbox. So the first thing you'll do after you click border, just click on your border color. Put that all the way to white. And then change your size. And this is going to vary from system to system. Uh, for me, I found that 20 works good for me. Probably 18. And that is it. Hit your home button again. And now that's going to be saved. And you can just use your, use your gun to play. I'm going to go over some button commands. 
So to leave your crosshair on, of course you just leave it on. If you want to take it off, you can just hit your mouse and the button, and we have no crosshair, which is how I prefer to play. Uh, this game you will have to reload, so do remember to reload after your six shot. If you don't, it's just going to throw you off, throw you off the seal. But that's going to be the right thing. The gearbox up here is what, how you can do your sound. You can just exit through here, or you can just restart your level. That's all there is to it. Just keep on shooting and just get as high of a score as you can. So as far as the game itself goes, that is it. Now let's go ahead and add some media to this. Now, of course, if you're not running this through LaunchBox, then this thing will apply to you. You can just end the video now. But if you want to add some extra media, I'll show you what to do. I actually have a media pack available in a previous video, so I'm going to share it here as well, and I'll show you how to install all that. Okay, so I have a link for this media down below. And when you get it, it's going to come up as a Blamcon Media. So you double click on that, you'll have this folder. And we can just pull it anywhere. I'll just pull it to my desktop. Because once you uh, do get this onto your launch box after we import it, it's going to put all the media directly where it needs to be. Alright, so let's open our launch box back up. And right click. You want to go to edit, edit metadata, come down to media, hit images, and we'll start here. So we're going to hit add, and let's go where you put that folder at. Let's put mine on the desktop, and it's Blamcon Media. So I want to want this right here. I want to open that, and you want to set that as your box front. Okay, we're going to add some more media. I want to add that same picture. But I want to use this next one as my fan art background. What that does is whenever you're inside Big Box, it's just going to populate this media during the loading screen. Hit add image again, and we're going to use this right here, and it's going to be our clear logo, because, you know, we need clear logos. All right, and now for our videos, we're going to add a cover video. So this is going to be what shows whenever you're selecting all your games, and this will be there. All right, hit F5 to refresh everything. All right, now as you can see, we have our clear logo. We have that. And we have this. Oh, one more thing. After you drop the video, make sure you change it video snap to uh, theme video. Then hit OK. Oh, one more thing. For the uh, video to show up, you do need to make sure that you are a big box member so after I drop my big box license now that I'm a big box paid member the uh, shooting gallery video shows up so when you're selecting the game on big box you'll have this video come up alright well anyway everyone um, that is it uh, get your guns going get in the uh, Facebook group get those scores up Enter those videos and only a free gun and also a bonus gift from, a bonus gift from Xbox himself. So, you know, we're talking about prizes worth over $500 easily. So, and it costs us nothing to enter. And uh, even if you're uh, not a member, still uh, put your entries in. We're going to run some random gifts for participants to win some retro gear. Anyways, y'all have a great day. I'll catch you on the next one. Later.